What's going on guys, I'm Bill and welcome to Bill's How To. So recently I uploaded a video on how to pick a padlock using paper clips. That video got over 6 million views. What I did notice however, was in the comment section there was a lot of constructive criticism around the padlock that I picked. So what I used was this clear transparent padlock right here. The reason why this one here is clear is so that you can see what's going on inside as you pick it and that'll help you develop your lock picking skills. A lot of people happen to say, this is a cheap lock, very easy to pick, especially using a paper clip. So what I've decided to do is go out and buy a master padlock and we're gonna see if we can pick it using the paper clips. Master, if you're not sure, is a reputable company, makes locks all around the world and it's on the high side when it comes to buying padlocks. So let's test it out guys and see if we can pick that lock using the paper clips. Let's do this. So the first thing we're gonna do is create our lock picking tools using these two paper clips here. We're gonna use this first paper clip and we're gonna create a tensioner tool. So all we wanna do is just bend this all out straight or as straight as possible. Once we've got that relatively straight, we're gonna get the two ends and bend them to each other. So once we've got that relatively straight, bend it over to each other. This little tip here, what I'm gonna use is a pair of pliers and we're gonna just crimp that down a little bit. Once that's done, the next thing we wanna do is take this looped section here, take the bottom of our keyway. You'll notice that there's a top section and a bottom section of the keyway. We're gonna put this down the bottom, about a centimeter in, and then we're gonna just bend that out to the side. Now that that's done, we've created a little tensioner tool. Next thing we're gonna do is create our lock picking tool, and to do that, all we're gonna do is just simply bend this section here out on about a 45 degree angle. So now we've got our lock picking tools ready to go. What we're gonna do now is test out the lock. Make sure everything's in working order. This one here is a brand new lock, so everything should be working fine. We'll take our tensioner tool, slot that down the bottom of the keyway, apply a little bit of tension using my finger. Now this video isn't gonna be a full in-depth tutorial as to how to pick the locks. If you guys wanna see that, put it in the comment section below. Um, what we're looking at here is to see if we can conquer the master lock using a paper clip. So let's get straight into it. I'm gonna pick these pins individually one by one, try to get a good grip and a good angle, and we'll get started. There we have it guys, nice and easy. Let's see, we'll give the lock with the benefit of the doubt and we'll try it one more time. Once again, take that pick. I can definitely feel that these springs and also the pins are better quality than it was in the cheap lock. It's starting to bend my paper clip unfortunately, um, so I'm not too sure if I'm going to be able to get this one. I can feel that last pin has a bit too much tension on it. So what I'm going to do in this case is I'm going to release some of the tension by taking the pressure off this um, tensioner tool and you'll hear a little click. Once that click comes through, can then reapply the pressure. I'm gonna also straighten this out a little bit, give me a little bit more leverage, and then we're gonna go through and try and get these pins again. The paper clip has definitely taken a beating, but are we gonna get it twice? Once again, I'll take the pressure off, And once we're done, there we have it guys. So it looks like the paper clip wins again, although we've got some battle scars. Um, at the end of the day, whether you've got a cheap lock or an expensive lock, seems to be the case that the paper clip wins every single time. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, I'm Bill. Thanks for watching Bill's Out Too.